Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Stella Rose. As you can tell, I have a different background in my videos. Uh, first, uh, first video since I've been gone for like two weeks again. Um, this past weekend, uh, since Wednesday up until Sunday, we had three rehearsals and three recitals. So we were rehearsing for my daughter's dance um, company on Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Then we had one program on Saturday and two on Sunday. So I, I had like no time to do any kind of filming or anything like that. The previous weekend, I was just like not having it. And <laughs> I'm sure you guys understand. I know I need to push through and everything. So I, I'm working on it. Okay. <laughs> I'm working on it. So, um, <clears throat> excuse me. We are back with another project pan. This is our second update. Well, first update. Um, last month we did, uh, actually, I think I've missed an update. No, I didn't miss an update. So I, the whole program or project program, um, started in April. It started April 15th and it goes until next April 15th. Um, but I started a month late. So I started May 15th. So this is my first update. It's like everybody else's second update. So this is just going to be the June update. Okay. <laughs> um, so everything in this product has some kind of green on it, whether it be, um, in the packaging, like right here, here's green or the product itself would be green. Um, so that is how this works or there's green somewhere, whether it be the lettering or whatnot. Um, it doesn't have to be like a significant amount of green or anything like that. It just needs to have green somewhere or it could be like a green item, like clean for the environment, something like that. Um, so we have 50 products. Um, I did do a combination of bath, uh, bath and body care, uh, skincare, hair care, um, candles, makeup, um, lotions, stuff like that. All right. And I gathered everything I could to try to make 50 items. And I'm honestly surprised I was able to do that. Um, so we're just going to go over the things that I have actually used in the last month, um, which isn't a lot. I'd say maybe about a third I've used. Um, I have a whole pile over here to my left that I haven't used. I'm kind of like trying to keep it over here to remind myself to use it now because this is a little ridiculous that I haven't used this, these items. So, um, <clears throat> first and foremost for the first item, um, I had a Bath and Body Works. Okay. I think I was at this. <laughs> I can edit it. So it's okay. All right, so the first item that I have on here is the Bath and Body Works Vanilla B Noel uh, 24 Hour Moisture Ultra Shea Body Cream. <gasps> Mouthful. Okay, so it started at 341 grams and now it is at 169. Sorry for blinding you guys. Um, so that is a change of 162, um, which is pretty good. I did use this. Um, I honestly don't know. When did I use this? I didn't think I used that much. Like, oh well, it, it was used, so we're good. Um, Next, we have the Pharmacy Deep Sweep. This is a cleansing toner from Pharmacy. It has BHAs in it. And it started at 284. Um, it is now at 260 grams, and that is a change of 24 grams. So, that is really good as well. I've been trying to use more skincare and trying to get back into a regime regimen. Yes, regimen of <laughs> of using skincare. Anywho, uh, yeah, if you guys just saw what was like right here, this little thing, that's our new puppy. Come on, babe. <laughs> Here's our new puppy. This is Yamper. And he is, as you could probably tell, a corgi. And he is going to be 10 weeks this Friday. He is so cute. He's got gray eyes. I've never seen a corgi with gray eyes. I think they are the most beautiful eyes on a dog that I have seen. Because you, you don't usually see um, gray, gray eyes on a dog. He's got a little bow. His name is Yamper Barrington. And then we have our last name as well on there. 
Um, and he is AKC certified, so um, we just have to get his stuff, babe. <laughs> get his papers registered and everything. Oh, who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Yeah. He's so cute. I love his ears. This one was down for the longest time. It was like down like, like this. Like it wasn't sticking up like it is now. Um, so we were kind of like worried that maybe it wouldn't stick up, but now he looks like Yoda officially. <laughs> Babe, stop. <laughs> okay, <laughs> enough cuteness. Okay, there can never be enough cuteness. Um, but anyway, if you see him like right here. <laughs> yeah, you can see him <laughs> right there. <laughs> anyway, let's get back to the video real quick and get this over with so I can go play with my Buffy. Anywho, um, okay, so we've got number three is the Glow Recipe Avocado. Um, I have not used that. I have not used the Naobe Cleanser. Um, down to number five, we did have the Mario Badescu spray. This is skincare. Um, so you could just like randomly spray it just like that. Just don't eat it. So I feel like I did just now. Anywho, um, so that one started out at 44 grams. It is now 40, which means we had a difference of four. Um, the Hemp's Chopstick, I did use this. I've been using this. Um, as you can tell, it is kind of worn away at the edges. Usually they come um, straight across. And so I have been using this. This has been in my purse. Um, but there isn't any change from the first, uh, the intro of this project. Um, and then I did spray this today. <laughs> Go me. Um, again, no change. This is the Ellis Brooklyn Sun Fruit. Uh, perfume. It smells really yummy. Um, we have the Earth Harbor Aurora. This is another item that is skincare. The item is actually green. Um, so that's what I'm talking about with green products. You can do do that or you can do green um, packaging and stuff like that. Um, so this one started out at 77. It is now 75. So that's a change of two. Um, we have the YSL, um, this one's the Black Opium Green Edition. As you can tell, the bottle is green in this little window right here. Same as the back. Honestly, I don't know if the liquid inside is green. I believe it's probably just the, the glass, but I have been using this. I keep it in my car or in my purse, depending on how I'm feeling and if it's hot out or not. Um, it started out at 122 grams and we are now at 115, which is a change of seven, which is great. I had four of these, um, masks. They were a Korean skincare from way golden root purifying mud mask. These are single use masks. You just take the item out of this and just put it on your face with like a brush or your finger. It doesn't matter. Um, and I do have three of them. Um, I had four, so I used one. Go me. Um, so those were my 10 through 13. So 10, 11, 12, 13. Um, so one is gone. So we're at three left, which is good. I have the native deodorant. This is the tie dye vanilla cupcake from baked by Melissa. This one smells so good guys. If you love I know it's weird to smell deodorant, but this doesn't even smell like deodorant. It smells seriously like cake batter, like vanilla cake batter. It is so good. Like I really want to eat it, but I know it's deodorant and it's been by my armpit. So I don't really want to, but it smells so good. <laughs> um, so it was 104 grams and it is now at 89, which is a change of 15 grams, which is really good. Um, I also have another deodorant that I had been using before this, um, project. So I kind of like switch back and forth. I mainly use this one cause this one is in the bathroom. Um, and then the other one's on my side table, uh, by my night on my nightstand by the bed. So either one, I mean, I'll just, I'll try to use that one. Cause that one, this one's in a project, but the other one is not. So I try to use the tie dye one a little bit more. Um, we have the Dr. Jart purifying mask. Um, I haven't used that. We had 
the Batiste dry shampoo. Haven't used that. Um, I did introduce the Marc Jacobs mascara. This is my absolute favorite mascara in the entire world. So upset that Marc Jacobs Beauty is no more. This is the Velvet Noir. Um, yeah, the Velvet Noir mascara is black. Um, the bristles on the wand are just amazing. It, you know, spreads my eyelashes out evenly. It looks really good. Uh, I think I have like two or three backups. <laughs> uh, but I've used it. I mean, not a lot, but the, the change has not happened. There is no um, gram change. Let's see. We have the Amica The Cure hair mask. And this was 34 grams. And it is now 19, which is a change of 15 grams. Um, I haven't really noticed a change in my hair when I've been using it. So I don't really, I don't think I would buy it. Um, this was just like a free sample with a purchase that I bought from Amika. And I haven't even used the product that I bought from Amika because I have so many other products. But it's about to be used. Once uh, some other stuff that's actually in this project is used, then that will be introduced to my hair and we'll go from there and see how it works for me. Um, next is my Ed Hardy perfume. I swear I've had this perfume for like eight years and it still smells almost the same. <laughs> I can't remember eight years ago what it smelled like, but I think it smelled the same. So we're just going to go that it smelled the same. So it was a hundred grams. It is now 99. <laughs> I haven't really used it that much, obviously. So, um, but still there's a change. So that's nice to see. We have the Lavender and Sage Hand Cream. I did not use that. The Briogeo Hair Mask. I did not use that. The Murad Night Cream. I have not used that. Tree Hut Body Scrub, which is my cotton candy one. Um, I have another one in another project. That's uh, the Peppermint. And uh, I have not used this one. But we did use the Garnier Skin Care or Skin Active Rose... <laughs> water rose micellar cleansing water um there's the green on the package see I'm reaching I'm really reaching okay <laughs> um but this one was 440 grams it is now uh 382 which is a change of 58 grams so I would I would use this to take off my eye makeup and my eyebrows that I somewhat drawn because I have bare eyebrows in certain places so I have to fix it. Um, so I use that pretty much every time I wear makeup. Um, it's it's not necessarily been daily. So this is, I, I marked it at the beginning of the product project. So it was up here and now it's down here. I haven't marked it yet, but now it's down to here, which is actually a pretty good movement for, uh, for me. <laughs> Next, we had the So Fresh Black Mask. It was a charcoal mask for like acne and whatnot. I haven't used it. Then we did, we had four candles. We had the Bath and Body Works Blackberries and Basil, um, which was this one. I, <laughs> I have not used this one. And then we had the Rainbow Candle. This one I haven't used since we put it in the project, but I don't know. It's literally probably within just a couple more uses. Um, so I should probably light that because this month is Pride Month anyway. Um, so I should probably light it. Um, then we have the vanilla bean Noel candle. I did light this a couple times, so that's what it is looking like. And then we have the coconut culotta. So I burned this maybe a couple times, if that, maybe just at least one time I burned it. Um, so those, those have been used besides the, the, the first two. Then we have the Briogeo conditioner and I marked it the wrong way because I keep this one, this bottle specifically like this upside down because it is near impossible to get the product out unless you have it upside down. Um, so this was measured from the top. Like it was measured like this. Do you see how hard it is to get down? It's not even going, it's not moving. So um, I'm just gonna remark it again today um, and just mark it up here and then we'll go down from there and then I'll just kind of like squiggle this out or something. 
Um, but that one was 344 grams. It is now 233, which is a change of 111 grams. Next is the shampoo. As you can tell, I have way, way more product in, I mean, it looks about the same, but you're, you're missing a half of it right here. Um, but you can tell like there's a big difference. Um, here's the mark. I've barely used it. Um, I use more conditioner because my hair is like really long. I know there's other people that have longer hair than me, but like just, <laughs> I mean, you can tell I have long hair. So, um, the beginning weight was 324 grams and it is now, uh, 285, which is only a change of 39 grams. That tells you how much I use of conditioner versus shampoo. Like that's terrible. I need to use more shampoo, but you don't really need to because I mean, it, you just, you just want to like wash your scalp and like the roots of your hair and then just get a little bit down here and then, but with a, the conditioner, I need it like from here down. Like, so I use a lot more conditioner because my hair is also really thick. <sighs> it's just annoying because you never, you never run out at the same time. If you have, if you use one or the other more than the other. Um, then we have the Vita bath. This is a bubble bath cream, cream, what? Bubble bath liquid, whatever whatever you want to call it. It's just bubble bath. Okay, guys, it's just a bubble bath. Um, it was 965 grams and now it is 813, which is the change of 152 grams. I've taken a few baths. I think I put it in for my wife as well one time. And then I think I've taken a, a few baths. Um, I don't really take a lot of baths. So that's why it's not like on a little bit more. Um, but it's fine. Uh, 33 is the Boom Boom Cream. Um, I have the giant container. This started at 639 grams. It is now 621, a negative 18 change. Um, I don't use a lot of lotion, if you can't tell by that not disappearing quickly. Um, so it is, it is imperative for me to try to use it a little bit more. Um, I love this smell. Um, it's like a, an almond smell. It's so good. I'll actually open it up and show you what it looks like inside. Cause I've used some, there are my finger marks in there. Um, but I mean, I still have so much, like, look at all this. It go, it's going to go all the way down to the bottom. Okay. Like it's literally back. It's, it's up at the top. I mean, I haven't really been using it. So, um, and then I have a bunch of sheet masks. I think I only used like a couple or maybe just one sheet mask. Like I have all these left. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see. One, two, three, four. Okay. I didn't use any guys. <laughs> I need to get better. Um, so yeah, that is those. Now the last things that we have, sorry, as I'm moving this stuff, um, we have my eyeshadows my green eyeshadows um, because I didn't have enough <laughs> green products to find in my house to use. Um, so this one's green. Um, it is the mycelium uh, from ColourPop. It's a single shadow. It isn't green inside. It is like a goldish color. Um, it's really pretty. It's very sparkly. I actually have it on today, like on my inner corners. Um, so that's that one. Then I believe I have both of these two shades in from the Meant to Be palette. Yeah, Meant to Be palette, um, bite size palette from e.l.f. Um, I don't have any of those on today. Then I have the, gotta make sure I'm putting the right colors in. I, um, it is L.F. and B.F. So L.F. is Little Frog down here. And then BF is baby face. So I use this one and I use this one. I also use this one today. So I use these three colors. Um, if you hadn't seen my update, my my introduction, this one fell out. It's really funny. Go watch that. Um, so I have used this palette. I think I did use this palette um, one of the times that I did my green makeup. Then we have the Aura and Out palette. Um, let me see. We have the HH in there, which is the Healing Heart, which is this one down here. I did use this one today. I use this color right here. 
Um, and then I don't know. I don't think we have the other one here. Nope. I was gonna. I was gonna say I don't know if this one's in there. It's not. It's just that one color, which is fine. Glam light street taco palette. We have these. I think just this one, the, the guacamole. I have no idea. Where is this? ST. I totally put the wrong thing on there. There is no ST in here. <laughs> it's this one. I need to go back to school. Then I have the color pop garden variety. There is only one green in here, so you can obviously find that. That is what I've been using. And last but not least, we have the Avocado Toast from BH Cosmetics. I miss them. I can't believe they went under or sold their company. Um, but I have the Avo, Avo Toast. And I think I have extra. Yep, I have extra. Sorry. Uh, Avo Toast um, extra. And I'm just making sure. Oh, there's another one. Green juice. I have these, this one, this one, and then this one in there. So, <sighs> so good Lord. I'm tired. I was a lot of products to go through and I didn't even tell you all of them. Like, you know, show, showed them all. So that is my update for June. I do, you know, enjoy having you guys comment below. So if you have any questions, if you have a video, I'd love to watch it. Let me know how you're doing. Um, and I hope everyone has a wonderful rest of the week and weekend and remember to stay beautiful.